Chris from 40 Thrive. Getting my sunlight. Because let me tell you, after what I dealt with yesterday, you definitely notice when you don't do it. Actually, two things I want to talk about today. <clears throat> A couple of significant things that I've uh, had to experience. And this is a perfect example as why it's important to make sure you're eliminating all the processed garbage out of your diet because your body is trying to tell you something and you're never going to get those clear direct signals if you're clouding it up with a bunch of junk. So first and foremost, let's talk about my back. I did a little brief video yesterday uh, where I thought I injured my back. It was a little tight and it was very obvious. You know, I've been working out pretty rigorously, pretty consistently. And it, it wasn't like I had to like figure out, well, I don't know, what did I do? It was like, no, the rest of me feels great. I've got a little bit of tension, this tightness in, you know, the muscle right above my, my glute. Um, if I move just a certain way, I know exactly what needs to be healed. So I didn't reach for any uh, ibuprofen or uh, acetaminophen or anything like that. I simply laid down on a heating pad uh, and by the next morning, I feel fine. I feel fine. And in fact, I'm surprised it, it actually healed that quickly. I thought it was going to be at least a day or two. But, uh, but I think that is a direct result of not bogging my body down with a bunch of unnecessary inflammatory uh, foods like grains. You know, imagine you're wearing this big puffy snowsuit and you know, someone's trying to give you a massage to work out a sore spot in your, in your body. It doesn't work out very well. Well, our bodies have these mechanisms. You know, our blood cells uh, are trying to heal areas of our body that may have an injury or inflammation. And they can't do our job if it's constant, if that signal's being interrupted by a bunch of unnecessary uh, foods and, and toxins that we're loading our bodies up with. So next I want to talk about... You know, I'm not perfect by any means. I'm still susceptible to the same types of, you know, seasonal depressions and stress. And last night I didn't sleep a wink. And I think that's largely in part because I skipped my sunlight exposure yesterday. I thought by running a couple early deliveries, jumping in and out of the car, oh, that's enough. It was not. I had absolutely... The hardest time trying to fall asleep last night. I had a route I was supposed to do this morning and I had to make a call at about 2.30 in the morning. I'm like, no, I, I literally shut my eyes about an hour ago. I'm not about to get out on the road and do damage to myself, probably do damage to God knows what else. So I'm out here this morning getting my sunlight. Um, I'm probably going to get my weights out here and start working out. So that is my message today. Don't skip on the things that matter. Sunlight, um, you know, eliminating garbage from your diet. I'm not saying you have to be 100% keto or carnivore, but at least stay whole foods, stay natural. All right, keep thriving.